Hey everybody, this is Ben Lewis over at FPA, and I am excited to have this opportunity to share this wonderful opportunity for all of our FPA chapters. Um, if you've been paying attention, you'll know that FPA has worked out this terrific partnership with the Financial Behavior Keynote Group. Uh, it's a group that's led by our good friend, Mary Del Carlson, who's joining us. Um, and it also includes the likes of Christy Archuleta, Michael Thomas, and Ryan Law. All of them are fantastic financial behavior researchers who do a lot of speaking and a lot of thought leadership on issues relevant to behavioral finance. And so they do all kinds of platform speaking, and they've got this great discount program available for FPA chapters. And so I wanted to have Mary join us to just provide an overview. And I know that Mary's also going to tell you about some newly modified discounted pricing that they've worked out. So everybody, here's Mary. Thank you, Ben. It's been an honor to work with FPA Chapters, and we're really excited to make uh, more opportunities for speakers. Actually, the four of us came together and said, it's really hard for event planners like yourselves to create these events and especially pick speakers one off. And so coming together and having the synergy hopefully simplifies your world and your process as well. So that's a, a background of where we came together. Kind of our background as researchers is each one of us has a research-based and evidence-based background. But the key is, is that we want to implement that into practice, right? We Each one of us also has a practice background where we have worked with real clients and real people, and we understand what it means to take research and implement it into practice. And so what we're hoping to do is expand the toolkit available for advisors, but making sure that we use evidence-based practices to be able to do that. And so our tagline is actually where evidence meets experience. And we're hoping to include that for many more chapters upcoming. So our website is keynote.financial. You can read all about us. We've done a lot in this world and but for many of you, but also for many other groups outside of FPA chapters. One of the most exciting parts that I'm excited to tell you about today is the new discounted pricing that we've uh, received or that we've given FPA chapters. One of the things that we've heard from you is please make it work for us and our chapters because we want you on stage. And so we thought about this long and hard. We wanted to one, simplify the process and two, make sure it works for your budget. And so with this new updated pricing, what everything is being charged off is an in-person speaker's fee. And you can see on this side-by-side -side pricing, we are discounting first off our lowest fees. So we each of us have ranges. We are actually starting with our lowest fees and giving FPA chapters an additional 20% off our lowest fee. So you as FPA chapters will either pay 4,000 or 6,400, depending on which speaker you're picking. Secondly, we typically, uh, for most outsiders, uh, take a 40% off the tier ranging uh, a pricing for in-person speaking. What we're doing for FPA chapters, and again, only available for FPA chapters, is 50% off those speakers fees. And so for a virtual event, you're either looking at 2,500 or 4,000 for any speaker. One of the things that we have done as well is a lot of people want recordings for anyone that couldn't make it or use it for up to a year afterwards. We typically charge $1,000 or more for the recording of that. For only FPA chapters, we are including up to three months of use with no additional charge. So if you want to record and use for anyone that couldn't come, we're including that in your pricing as well. And probably the biggest change or one of the biggest changes we're including is this booking fee. Typically, booking fees are based on a percentage of the full cost of the event. And what we're doing for FPA, and again, I want to emphasize this is only available for FPA, is we have just taken away any percentages and said it's a $500 flat fee. And that is for any event that you host, whether it's a webinar, whether it's an in-person event, and that is based on a per event basis. So that is our absolutely lowest price. And we are really excited to include that for you all. Now, one of the special things that we are doing only for FPA once again, and that is not available to anyone else outside, is we are still honoring our additional 20% discount on any virtual chapter events that we do if you have 400 uh, active paid members or not. So when I say additional 20% off, I mean an additional 20% off 
that $2,500 or $4,000 fee as well. So that is a deeply discounted pricing for you smaller chapters to make it work with your smaller budgets. And then last but not least, we are doing multiple events and growing rapidly. And so one of the features of any, especially in the metropolitan areas where we are already booked to speak somewhere else, you get an additional 15% off the $4,000 or the $6,400 pricing. But in addition to that, and I want to emphasize this, you don't pay any travel cost. So if we are already in the area, you're not paying the travel cost, you're getting an additional discount, and um, we're trying to make it work for everything that you have. Now, one of the things I did want to emphasize is these are for speeches that we already have prepared. You can find all of the speeches. There's a big, diverse grouping of those speeches, everything from communication skills to psychology of money to even a lot of DEI, and we're looking to add more DEI initiatives on our website soon. So any presentations you already see on there is available for that discounted pricing. If you're wanting something new or maybe customized, then we need to look at additional pricing and that won't be as available for the deeply discounted pricing we have here. But we will work with you on that if that's something you desire. And so in the last part, I've broken it up for you. Christy and Michael Thomas will be our $6,900 speakers, only available again for FPA. And that includes the booking fee. So that's after everything is paid for. That includes the three-month recording as well. That's $6,900 for an in-person event for them. And then Ryan and myself are a flat $4,500 for any in-person event. And then we'll honor all the other discounts down the road. So we hope this new pricing works for you. We're really excited to get the word out. We are looking at expanding as well. And so keep updated with us. We're hoping to add some new speakers and include more on there. But there's so much that we can offer for your chapters and for your members. And we hope to bring that to a city wherever you are. That's awesome, Mary. Well, look, I really do appreciate you taking just a few minutes to explain this this really terrific opportunity for FPA chapters. You know, we've uh, we, we hear loud and clear that our members really get a lot out of the education opportunities that are available through their local chapters because it makes you know the education the learning more personal because mm -hmm. they're right there. They now that we're post COVID, it's more face to face. Um, and so this is just an opportunity to really kind of augment what the chapters are already doing, which is really great. Um, but being able to bring in people like you and Ryan and Michael and Christy is just, it's just fantastic. So I appreciate the partnership on behalf of FPA. Um, you know, this is the kind of thing that we're trying to bring to our chapters. And, and I really hope that all of our chapters that are tuning in to watch this, um, really kind of uh, take this opportunity. I mean, really kind of look at your programming for, for 2023 and see how you can plug, um, you know, Mary and Christy and Michael and Ryan into your slate of speakers uh, for this next year. Um, Cause it's, it's right there for you. Just got to take advantage of it. So hey, and let me add to, I'd love to hear from the chapters. So as you guys have varying needs or different ideas or things that rise maybe in your chapters, please don't hesitate to reach out because that's what we want to do is we want to hear what your needs are and definitely meet those needs. So as you're growing and expanding, let us know. We are not, I do want to make one distinction too, is we are fully focused on financial behavior change. So we like to call that the emotional intelligence side of financial planning. We are not at all doing any of the technical speaking. So it adds kind of a nice congruence because a lot of times in chapters, we get really heavy on the technical side of financial planning. And we're hoping to bring in this emotional intelligence side that really adds the relational side and the psychology side of financial planning as well. Thank you for, for providing that context. I think that's going to be helpful for everybody. You bet. Excellent. Well, thank you again, Mary. I appreciate you taking the time. And again, everybody definitely, definitely, definitely uh, explore what Mary and the team there at Financial Behavior Keynote Group are offering all of our FPA chapters 